Hello, welcome everybody to another Facebook Friday, right? Another Felici Friday. Summer has like sprung, not even spring. We like, I think we generally just like skip right past spring. So definitely we have done that this, this year. It is summer, it is hot. I've got my fans going, I've got the windows open. It is a beautiful summer day. Hello, Philomena. Thanks for joining me. You guys, we have so much fun new stuff to play with today. Hey, Susie. We have our new, where is my annual catalog? It's already buried. I've been able to check it out and play with it. It's Yeah, it's like seriously buried, but yeah. We have our new annual catalog, the new 2022-23 annual catalog, and I can open it up and flip through the pages and share with you all the good stuff we have in here. We are, we're, what are we gonna play with today? Let's see. We are gonna play with the T Boutique Designer Series paper. So this is one that I'm giving away um, for an online order, and I think I showed you guys this paper last week, um, but check it out. It's beautiful. So there's one side of the paper. Hello, Miss Teresa. And then here is the other side. So we've got some kind of beautiful floral prints, lots of like teapots, and then just some fun, bold, bright, like this is one of my favorite, actually both of these, some of my favorite patterns on this side with the stripes and then kind of I don't know, is that plaid? Plaid, I guess I'd say. Um, anyway, so we are gonna be playing with this designer series paper today on Facebook Live. Thank you, Susie. I know I love the paper too. And then also, this is gonna be the new must-have set of dies this year. I've already got one, actually a couple pulled out. I'll show you. These are called the Stylish Shapes dies. So I've actually got two circles and one of the banners in the back here that I'm gonna be, I always do this so that I don't get myself confused when we go to make these colors. Cards, um, that I'm going to share with you in just a little bit. I have to put the ones that I'm going to use back here. So these are all the extra. And they have stitching on them too, right? They're called, yes, uh, no, the Stylish Shapes dies, but they have stitching around the edge of all of them too. So we have, what is that, four different squares. We've got four different banners. And then I think we have like six different circles, again, with stitching. So we had something similar um, in the past. This is kind of a new revised like set of stitched dies, but these are, like I said, these are gonna be the go-to. I'm gonna probably use these like every single week. It's gonna get ridiculous. So if you have not had a chance to get them yet, make sure you do the Stylish Shapes dies. These are gonna be the must-have. So we're gonna play with those today. Um, fun layering that you can do with these dies too. Okay, um, so let's see, I've got, always have my notes. Oh, wanna just tell you guys, we had, I'm like bouncing off the walls, right? Cause I have class, this always happens to me when I have class after Facebook Live, I'm always like, okay, we gotta get through everything so that I can get done in a reasonable time and get to class. Um, Cause yeah, otherwise people will be like, you know, waiting at the door for me and I'm not even there, which it pretty much happens anyway. But story of my life, I'm like <laughs> rolling in at the like, you know, one o'clock starts at one o'clock, doors are gonna be open at one o'clock, probably not a minute before, but that's all right. I said one o'clock, right? Um, so yeah, but we had our one day retreat last Saturday too. I have not done one of these. So with COVID, we kind of just like nixed it for a while. And I think everyone was so excited to be back and able to do like to get together like that. So I think I had close to 20 people at our retreat here at Alma last Saturday. We did it 9 a.m. to 9 p.m. <clears throat> excuse me, my good friend Stacy, who is like an avid paper crafter now also came and hung out with me for the day and helped so much. So Stacy, when you're watching later, Facebook Live, thank you so much for all of your help last Saturday. We had a great day. I think every, well, everybody had a great day. We, um, we made lots of good food. We had lots of snacks. I made cute little treats. I gave all the like, what, I, what do I call them? Table treats. My friend Jane from many years ago said, don't call them pillow gifts because we're not spending the night, right? She's like, call them table treats. So that's what I call them now. So I had cute little table treats that I made for everybody. We had one sitting out with their goodie bag of products when they got to their um, de desk, station, table, whatever we're going to call it, um, that morning. And then I had another little treat that I made for everybody later in the day. Um, we just had some, we had make and takes. Actually, I do have, I did bring the make and takes over so I can show you guys those. So everybody got a package because the timing was so weird. It was May 7th. So even though the annual catalog was live, I didn't, I wasn't able to order new annual catalog product 
um, cause I had to order it in April and I couldn't get multiples of everything that I needed cause I had 20 people there. So I had to get like 20 packs of designer series paper. So we went with the flowering fields designer series paper. Love, love, love that paper. Hey Sunday, how are you? Uh, so let's see. So this is one of the make and takes that they um, got to make again, featuring that flowering fields designer series paper. They also got a couple of yards of that evening evergreen window pane check ribbon so they could use that on their projects. And then they got a pack of the butterflies those brushed brass butterflies right so that was one of the make and takes this was another cute one that they made too again with more of the flowering fields designer series paper the cute little so the medium daisy punch carried over the big large one did not here is another one they also got a full bolt of the fresh freesia ribbon so that they could use that on their projects too and then more of that flowering fields designer series paper and then this one, just in the nick of time, if somebody needed a Mother's Day card, they could stamp Happy Mother's Day, or you could put whatever sentiment you wanted on there. But again, more of the Fresh Freezer ribbon and um, the little brushed brass butterflies. So beautiful make and takes. I love to do that. So I give everybody product as like a thank you for coming for the day. And then I love to feature the make and takes and the table treats that I made for everybody um, featured product from the goodie bag so that they could see like, okay, this is how I can use my goodie bag products also. So love to be able to do that um i do not have a date yet i've already had people asking i need to kind of check the calendar and see what's going on um both of my kids are going to be away though this is going to be weird um lily goes to school uh -huh. that's another thing we just went to orientation she got to um, sign up for her classes for next fall and winter she's going to grand valley state university hey jane how are you thanks for she was um hanging out with us last Saturday at the retreat too so good to see you on here Miss Jane um, so anyway yeah just yesterday we went all day long down to Grand Valley to get her set up for classes they had like a parent kind of orientation so they gave us a ton of information too which was great at, you know it just makes you feel more comfortable um, but actually um, yeah so both of my kids are gonna be away so I don't know why I kind of feel like I have to well, I don't know. Do I have to figure out their schedule anymore? I mean, they're basically both going to be gone. What I need to figure out, hello, Brenda, is when I can get them back, like what weekend I can get them back to come help me with it because it's so much work to get everything set up. And then probably the even more work is at the end of the night, so 9 o'clock when everybody goes home, we got to put everything away and put it all back the way we found it. And there are tons of tables and chairs that they use at the church that they like set up in a specific way, which I completely understand. But Holy mackerel, after the end of a long day, um, Cade was my savior. He came in and um, basically I was like, okay, tables go here, chairs go here, and he just kind of did everything while my friend Stacy and I got stuff packed up and cleaned up. So huge help, and I'm gonna, like I said, I gotta figure out when I'm gonna do the retreat based on when I can get those two kids back to help me um, with the retreat. So I'll keep you posted on that. But yeah, it was a great day. Um, like I said, just everyone I think had a fabulous time just because we haven't been able to do it in so long. So wonderful. If you get the chance, pamper yourself. Go to one of those one day or the weekend retreats or even better. Um, that's the fun part, like when you can go on a weekend one because you can stay up super late, which I'm kind of a night owl, so I love to do that. So nine o'clock is like the middle of the day when you get to spend the night. We're up till like two o'clock in the morning most times. So yeah, lots and lots of fun, but I'll keep you posted on that. Um, oh, okay. So want to do a quick reminder about In Color Club. I have an example of everything that you get in let me just scoot. I'm always like trying to keep myself organized here. Um, so I make sure I tell you guys everything. Okay, so in Color Club, if you're interested, we have the most fabulous, beautiful new set of in colors. And actually that um, T Boutique Designer Series paper features all of our new in colors too. So you can kind of get a, here, this one is, I'm gonna call that Starry Sky. Um, nope, not the yellow. This one is a uh, sweet sorbet. Okay, let's see. Where are some more? Okay, I feel like I have more. Oh, yeah. Okay, flip it over on the other side. This one is going to be Orchid Oasis. And what do we have? The green. This one is going to be Parakeet Party. And what's the other one? The turquoise. The Tahitian Tide. Okay, this is kind of Tahitian Tide. So this one right here. Right, okay. So this is kind of example because I took my in color cards 
um, to class already. I got those set up there. But here's an example. These are all of our five new in colors. So for example, Starry Sky. If your first month you get Starry Sky products in the in color club, you are going to get a full package of designer series paper. You are going to get a full ink pad. Obviously, you can't get a partial ink pad, right? You're going to get a full um, ink refill. You are going to get the Starry Sky Blends markers. You are going to get the Starry, Starry Sky Stamp and Write marker. You are going to get the Starry Sky, uh, gold, what is this called? This is called the Mm, metallic woven ribbon. You are going to get the Starry Sky, Starry Sky Designer Series paper, and you are going to get the Starry Sky twine. So I don't know if I can like lift that all up, but basically this is, ah, <laughs> this is everything you get in In Color Club each month for five months. You're going to get all of that in one color one month and then the next month the next color and so on over five months so you kind of spread it out you can budget so you don't have to buy everything all at once but by the end of the five months you get everything in all of our new in colors you um let's see oh one month you're also the host and you automatically receive the new in color matte decorative dots. The um, other ones are up here. The, what are those? The, 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 the sweet sorbet. You can't see the pinky red ones, but the sweet sorbet, but you get a full package of these. And then you also get to pick $20 in product, whatever you want the month that you are the host. So it's an awesome deal. It is $56 over the five month period. You can pay cash, check, credit card, PayPal, whatever is easier for you. I am easy like that. Um, so if you are interested, I'm still um, letting people get into the In Color Club. I've already put my first order in, but as more people are kind of seeing the colors and like, oh, I want to get everything in all of those colors. Like I said, if you want everything in all five of our brand new In Colors, the In Color Club is the way to go. Uh, plus, I always send you cute little club member treats each month too. So love to get you signed up. If you have any interest, um, if you have any questions, let me know. The link to actually more info and to sign up will be um, in the details above this Facebook Live video after I get it uploaded today. So let me know if you have any questions on that. Okay, um, let's see. I have like stickies on things. And I'm like, oh, what is that? Okay, so all right, I'm good with that. Let's see, we're gonna put this stuff over here so it's kind of out of the way. So we talked about In Color Club Designer Series Paper Share. I'm gonna just show you super briefly because I'm going to, um, hey Julie, hello, hello. Um, I am gonna flip through all of this paper when we turn the camera down because I don't want it to be backwards. But this is a Designer Series Paper Share. So you can see we've got some six by six paper right there and then look at all of this, all of this 12 by 12 paper, I cut it in half. So you essentially get a quarter pack of all of the designer series paper, the new paper in our new annual catalog. Um, how much is my designer series paper share? I gotta look at that. Um, $44 for all of this. Can you guys see like that's a huge pack of paper. Um, then you get like a little sample of everything, right? I have so much fun, I always say this, like cutting this paper and packaging up and getting it sent out to everybody because I get to like look at it and see all of this. I There's so much paper in here and I'm gonna be honest, like some of it I was like, eh, that's okay. Like I wasn't that excited about it in the catalog and then you get it in your hands and you're like, oh yeah, this is beautiful paper. Um, let's see, you actually also get, this is the Host Designer Series paper. Can't remember the name of it, but we'll pull those up and, and look at those. So I'll show you guys this in a little bit more um, detail when we flip the camera down because I want you guys to see all this beautiful paper. It is just gorgeous, like I said. Okay, so we're gonna keep that right there so I don't forget to do that. Um, okay, I think we're ready. Let's do our drawing for the pastel pearls, right? So your name is in the little basket if you shared the last Facebook Live video. If you shared my class to go, don't forget that's something new. So anytime you see that class to go post, and I have a new class to go, I'm gonna show you guys in just a couple minutes. Um, if you share that class to go, or if you're new to me and you sign up for my email list, which the link to do that is also always um, above the Facebook Live video after I get it uploaded. Okay, oh wait, and the pastel pearls. You guys wanna see, this is what we're drawing for, the beautiful, thank goodness those carried over, because I love, they're just, 
I don't know, bling, whatever. Anytime you can add a little bobble on something, it's like what I do. It's my last, I put ribbon, ribbon, twine, thread, something, and then um, bling on pretty much every card because I have to have um, all that texture too. So hello, Susan. Thanks for joining us. Okay, so here we go. One lucky winner of the pastel pearls. I got one in my hand. I do, I do. Miss Candy Rucker. All right, congratulations, Candy. I will get these pearls sent out to you. So thank you so much for, uh, I think she signed up on my email list. So thank you for doing that, Miss Candy. Okay. All right, next Facebook Live, what are we going to give away? <laughs> this good morning, Miss Susan. Um, we are going to give away the beautiful, love these iridescent rhinestones, more bling. I love, look, kind of like a pearly almost. You can see all the different colors you can pick up. So they work with just about everything. So again, share this video, share the class to go uh, post, and sign up for my email list, and your name will be in our next drawing for the iridescent rhinestones. Okay. Um, oh, you guys know what else? Um, let's see. So I want to remind you guys, if you don't know about this already, and actually say in advance, congratulations, Miss Gwen Lorenk just bought the starter kit, the awesome starter kit deal that Stampin' Up! has going on right now. It's kind of like an in-color starter kit deal. So this it's the standard, you pick $125 in product, and pay only $99 plus sales tax, that 11% shipping fee now, it went up from 10% to 11% with the new annual catalog or May 1st or something. Um, anyway, it's 11%, maybe it was April 1st, I don't know, whatever, it's 11% now, but that's waived, you don't have to pay shipping. And, okay, I've gotta check my notes here because you also get all of these in-color products free as well, plus that $125 in stuff product, whatever you want. So you get all of the ink pads, so all five colors of our new in color ink pads. You get the assorted pack of cardstock in all five of our ink um, in, in colors. You get the full package of designer series paper that has all five of our in colors, and you get this awesome in color grid paper. So those four things in addition to $125 in product, and you pay only $99 plus sales tax. Again, that 11% shipping fee is waived. So awesome deal. It's going on now through the end of May, so you've got some time to think about it. Hey, Miss Vina, you're so cute. Good morning, Amy and Stampers, yes. I love that, like we're all Stampers. We all have so much fun playing with our um, craft room supplies and things. And Vina, uh, Maria was at the, re at the retreat last weekend, so I told her to tell you hello and was asking how you're doing. So it was fun to catch up with her a little bit too. So, and then actually Lily, my daughter, babysat for um, your would be great granddaughters, right? So Maria's little girls, Lily got to babysit for them while Maria and her husband went golfing the other night. So that was cute. So, and Amy, hello, thanks for joining us. Amy got to make it to the retreat with us also. So lots and lots of fun we had. Um, oh, okay, so back to the starter kit deal. Don't forget too, so it's that awesome deal. Plus then you also get a 20% discount on all of your orders after that. So um, just a super awesome deal. Love to get you signed up if you're interested. You might as well just become an inspired stamper, right? Get the starter kit through us. You get so much awesome good stuff. You get my um, demo design dream team PDF tutorials for free every month. Any of my class to go kit tutorials, you can get those for free. You get the make and takes at a good price on those class to go kits. And we're just a great group of ladies that are kind of fun to hang out with. So let me know. Again, if you have any questions, love to get you um, signed up on that starter kit and get you rolling on getting your 20% discount on all of the awesome product in our new annual catalog too. So, okay. Um, I'm like doo -doo 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 -doo, going like a million miles an hour. Um, 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 okay, so we talked about that, we talked about that. Okay, I think we are just about ready to do our next drawing. I'm gonna grab a, grab a quick sip of water. How am I doing on time too? Okay. All right, <clears throat> can't be late for class. Okay, so we are gonna do our next drawing, but let me do a quick recap so everybody knows if you put an online order in through me, which I always, I say this every time, but I truly, truly mean it, that I truly, truly, truly appreciate all of your online orders. So as a thank you for your online order, you always get the projects that I made on our last Facebook Live. So if you ordered through me, you're gonna get both of these in color cards, which I should have been looking at these, right? <laughs> I 
know, Robin, I'm out of breath for you. I know that's, I, I'm like out of breath for myself too. I think, um, so I worked out pretty hard this morning, which that always makes me out of breath. And then like this heat, like our bodies are not used, like, like last week it was 50 and now it's like 90. So our bodies are not used to this like heat yet either. So anyway, sorry, I'm like probably wearing everybody out. Hopefully not. Hopefully you're just sitting back and relaxing and laughing that like Amy is going a million miles an hour. So, okay. So anyway, as a thank you, you get these two cards from me um, as your thank you very much for your online order, right? You also, let's see. Um, get your name in the drawing for that beautiful pack of the, why am I drawing a blank? The tea, I was gonna say cup of tea, the Tea Boutique Designer Series paper. If you bumped your order up to $50, you get to pick from our free embellishment for May, this is May, which are the 2021, 2023 in color opal rounds and these are beautiful can you guys see so we've got all of our in colors hello bonnie um that were that came out last year that are around for one more year so these are gorgeous opal rounds in our in colors and so you get to pick from that the free embellishment or the demo design dream team pdf tutorial which this month the theme was product from our new annual catalog um so here you can kind of see we have 16 different projects. We put pictures in here, step-by-step -step tutorial on how to make all of the projects in here, all 16 of them. That didn't flip super well, but I wanna show you guys, this is my project that I designed this month and it's got a fun little flip on it right there too. So you can get all the details on that card in the Demo Design Dream Team PDF tutorial free with a $50 order. Okay, so let's do our drawing. Your names are in my little basket. Again, if you put an online order in through me, you, one lucky person is going to win the T Boutique Designer Series paper. Okay, so hold on. I'm seeing I've got, I gotta make sure I have the, I thought I dumped them all out, but I didn't quite, because I, I only had a couple of online orders. So I'm gonna make sure I only have online order people names in here because I was like, wait a minute, I think I have more papers in here than I should. Okay, so yeah, so you guys, chances are really good. I mean, I seriously had two online orders last week. So one of these two people that ordered is gonna get this designer series paper. So odds are so good um, if you order through me because I don't get that many online orders. So whenever I give something away, your chances are really, really good at winning it. Okay, so here we go. The winner of the Tea Boutique Designer Series paper is Bonnie. You have perfect timing. Miss Bonnie Pasnernick is the winner. Teresa, hello, thanks for joining us. So Bonnie, I will get your designer series paper sent out to you along with the cards as the thank you. And then Bonnie, let me know, because I don't think I've heard from you whether you would like the Demo Design Dream Team PDF tutorial or the free embellishment, which are those in color opal rounds. Either one of those is free to you for your $50 order. So I'll get those sent out to you as well. Okay, all right, we are racing along here, trying to keep organized as always. Okay, we're good with all of this stuff. We're good, we're good, we're good. Okay, so on our next Facebook Live, this is such a cute stamp set. This is what we're gonna give away free. Someone will win this with an online order. Make sure you use the host code through me. It's always in the details above our Facebook Live video. It's always on my blog at Gathering Ink with a K, so gatheringinspiration.com. If you need it, you can always just um, get a message to me and I'm happy to send you the information too. But I try to get it posted. Um, like on Facebook, um, I always am posting about, you know, putting an order in and the host code. I try to include that there too. So, but this is what we're gonna give away on our next Facebook Live is the Sending Smiles stamp set. So beautiful, you're welcome, Miss Bonnie. Um, beautiful stamp set. And I love that you can kind of build sentiment. So you've got sending. And then you can add smiles across the miles. That's cute. So if you have somebody that lives further away from you, you can send a little card that says that. Sending all the good luck your way. That one's cute, right? Sending sunshine to brighten your day. Um, sending love and big hugs. That's cute, right? How about sending birthday wishes? Um, sending a note of thanks. Um, sending a card to say hello. And then last one, how about sending comfort and strength? So an awesome set of sentiments. And then this beautiful kind of floral imagery that you can build kind of a whole like wildflower garden with um, the stamps in there as well. It's photopolymer too. So you guys can see that, right? So 
They're the clear stamp, so they're really easy to stamp um, and kind of line things up because you can see right through your clear box. So one lucky winner for putting an online order in for me will be um, receiving that Sending Smile stamp set on our next Facebook Live. We'll do that drawing. Okay. <laughs> I think we're ready. Let me just make sure. Yeah, okay, we are ready. We're gonna flip the camera down. And I'm gonna show you the Designer Series Paper Share first, because I'm afraid I'm gonna forget that. And then we'll move on and we'll um, uh, do our stamping. Okay, so, all right, here we go. Turn your heads away, we're flying through the air. Okay, get this set up. Okay. Okay, we're flipping, we're good, we're not sideways. I'm still always so worried about that. Okay, so again, here is our designer series paper share. Hello, Miss Tracy. We have uh, just a million packs of designer series paper in the annual catalog. I had meant to open that up. I wonder if I'm gonna be able to do that. Let's see if we can find the names of these things as we're flipping through here too. Okay, sorry, I'm over here on the side finding my catalog. Because I want, I don't know the names of probably most of these at this point. Okay, so I'm at the right, so you guys can see, right? So this, um, like this paper did not catch my eye at all. This is called the Abigail Rose. It's so beautiful in person. This is beautiful, a wash in beauty. Butterfly Kisses is super duper cute. Um, the Happy Forest Friends, this is another one. Oh my gosh, you're gonna just love this. Awesome masculine paper, he's the man. Hues of Happiness, I've been playing with this. This is actually what my class to go is featuring. Lovely in Linen, this is another one that doesn't look like much, but it's beautiful. And then Perfectly Penned, I'm not a huge like black and white girl, but this is beautiful also. And I can see like some great uses for that black and white paper. This Pretty Prince paper is gorgeous also. Um, what else? The sun prints, all the beautiful blues, some of our new in colors. Tea Boutique, again, that's the one that I've showed you guys a couple of times already. And then this texture chic, oh, it's super shimmery and beautiful. And then you're also going to get um, some of this, what is it called? Design a Daydream, the host designer series paper. Okay, so those are all the names, so I can hopefully kind of refer to them as I show you guys this paper. And again, keep in mind, this whole pack of paper is just $44. So it's an awesome deal to get all of this designer series paper. Okay, so here we go. We're gonna flip through here so you guys can see. And I'm gonna try to kind of spread these out. Is that what we're gonna do? Like, okay, so this paper, <laughs> this is the um, Butterfly Kisses. I mean, seriously, like, look at this paper. Isn't this, like, the cutest paper ever? I just can't get enough. Like, I didn't understand how how super cute this was. It is six by six paper, so you are, I don't know, you are a little more limited in what you can do. Obviously, you can't do, like, a long strip on a scrapbook page, although you could, like, cut it in half and then do, like, one half and another half. So you can make it work, right? But So here's one side of the Butterfly Kisses Designer Series paper. If we kind of flip it over and then look, here's like another kind of color palette on the other side. Can you guys see? I'm not doing a great job, but you kind of get the idea, right? Maybe I should move this paper out of the way too so we can spread them out a little bit more. I, I need to keep my um, catalog in view though. So there, okay, so that's kind of the idea, right? Okay, so that's the Butterfly Kisses paper. This must be our new fresh, well, not new anymore, right? But the Fresh Freesia. But I mean, seriously, isn't that like about the cutest paper? I don't know, I just, I want like 15 packs of that paper, I think. Okay, so that's one. Then we've got the Tea Boutique. And I feel like, did I pull a few of these out? These are not all of them. Oh yeah, I pulled them out to show you <laughs> the end colors. I was like, wait a minute, this is not all of our... You guys kind of see, okay, I don't, there we go, huh? Okay, so there's kind of one side of the Tea Boutique Designer Series paper. Then we've got the other side, and then you've got um, a bunch of patterns with the little cup, teacups and teapots. I love some of this floral imagery too, and then just some really pretty prints also. Okay, so there's Tea Boutique. I'm gonna have to do a better job at this, aren't I? Okay, then we have, this is the host, Designer series paper. Okay, here's all of this. Maybe we'll kind of like lay it out. Is that what we should do? 
You guys kind of see, isn't this so pretty? I think it's so saffron, which is a color like that kind of pale yellow that I don't use too, too much, but I love with the Blackberry Bliss. And then that's either Pool Party or Coastal Cabana. But look at the little bikes. Isn't that uh, just so cute? Okay, so that is one side of, oh man, I flipped that, didn't I? That is called the Design a Daydream. Do you think I can do this? Maybe I'll use two hands. Look at that and that, right? Okay, well, kinda. Woohoo! there we go. Okay, so there's another side of that designer series paper. Isn't that, oh, so many pretty patterns, right? Oh, it's beautiful. Okay, so that's the host designer series paper. That one is free with, so host rewards start with $150 order and it's actually 18 host dollars is what it takes to order that full package of paper. Next we have, this one is called the Pretty Prince Designer Series Paper. So let's see if we can see all of those, right? So here's one side of the paper, right? And then we're gonna flip these over. Oops, that one did not flip. And then there is the other side of the Designer Series Paper. Beautiful, right? Lots of gorgeous, deep, rich colors. Next, we have the Texture Chic, and this is one. Can you guys see the gold? Oh my gosh. Can you see all the like fun gold accents on that paper, right? So there's one side. This is easier now. I've got like packages that I can actually pick up. Okay, so this is going to get much more fluid now, ladies, but look at, isn't there's something, I don't know, they're just so cool. These patterns are really, oh, that's like seashells on there too. Yeah. Oh, I know. Oh, so many good ones, right? Okay, so then we have, what is this one called? This is the He's the Man designer series paper. That is gonna be one side of the paper, right? Look at these cute little like camp, <laughs> the little campers and the tents. Aren't those fun? This is like a farming one or something, right? <laughs> and then here's the other side. So just good, like strong masculine paper on that one, right? Then we have, this is called the Lovely in Linen. And this is one that, like I said, I think is really like so much more beautiful in person than I thought it was in the catalog. It kind of, it did catch my eye because I liked the sweet, um, but I, I like it even more now that I see the paper. Okay, so that's one side. I think because I love those patterns. And then here, look at, these are like the blues and greens on this side, right? So you've got like a nice variety, right? You can use like those kind of brighter or these like deeper colors, right? Some good masculine prints in there too. Now this one is called, what is this one? Oh yeah, this is the Abigail Rose. So this is one that like, it didn't really catch my eye, but I think like that's probably my favorite pattern in there. And then this is cool too, which um, I don't even know, are there like teeny tiny flowers? But I kind of look at that and I think it's got a masculine look to it also. But isn't that, it's really beautiful. Beautiful, right? Okay, so they got some nice floral imagery on that side. And then on um, this one is kind of funny, like a, so here, this is, I'm an accountant, right? So like way back when I first started my CPA career, we actually used <laughs> like ledger paper like this. I can't even believe we used to use that. Uh, yeah, before computers, before we all had computers, right? But okay, so isn't that beautiful also, right? So just, oh my gosh, so much good stuff. And it's only $44, guys, for all of this paper too. Um, next, we have the Hues of Happiness. And again, this one I'm going to show you guys in a sec. My class to go features the Hues of Happiness bundle. So actually, you get a full package of this paper in that class to go too. And check out those. Aren't those cool? Look at those fun patterns, right? On that side, bright, bold. That's my kind of paper right there, that bright, bold paper. Okay, the perfectly penciled. This is our black and white paper. That again, I don't I guess I'm not as drawn to black and white, but then you put it like with a pop of color and it's amazing, right? Okay, so you can, can you kind of see this is like six different patterns on this side. And then here's the back side of all of those too. Aren't they? Oh, yes, so much beautiful paper. Okay, this is the super cute the um Happy Forest Friends. Okay, I gotta like spread this out. Like, look at the little owl and the fox, little mushrooms, oh, leaves. How about that one? Isn't that cute? And then just some more fun, like forest. 
and the little bears, the cute, they're like sweet little bears and foxes and owls on there too. Isn't that just so stinking cute? Okay, and then here's the backside. So if one of those doesn't like float your boat, then you've got some more simple kind of um, monochromatic patterns on this side of the paper, right? Okay, are we on? I think we're almost, we have two more to go. So now we have, what is this one? It is called the Sun Prints Designer Series paper. And isn't this beautiful? All these beautiful prints and with our in colors, with our new Orchid Oasis and Starry Sky. Love that stripe on there, right? Okay, so there's one side. And then here is the other side of the paper. So again, with some more, I think um, gray granite is the other color in here too, but just with some kind of more muted tones. And then last, but certainly not least, what is this one called? This is, oh yes, the Awash in Beauty designer series paper. And it is truly, right, like a wash in beautiful colors. Look at all of that fun, beautiful floral imagery. And then here on the back side again. So they keep they keep it kind of crazy on the one side and then more um, subdued. This, I love that pattern too. It's like the plaid, right? So beautiful set of designer series paper. Again, you get all of this paper for just $44. So if you're interested, let me know. I would love to get one of these packs of designer series paper, the sampler sent out to you. Um, the link again is above the Facebook Live video right here um, if you're interested in ordering that designer series paper. Okay, I need another sip of water. Let's see, oh, somebody was here. <laughs> mm. It's funny, I thought I heard um, a, like the, the screen door close. <laughs> like, okay, what's going on? Okay, so we're all good. Somebody's here and gone and they got whatever they needed off of the porch, which is very, very handy. Okay, so I gotta get all my details here. So Hues of Happiness class to go. Featuring this awesome stamp set, the Happiness Abounds stamp set. Awesome set of sentiments, right? Sending many thanks for all you do. Congratulations. You are wonderful in every way. Wishing you all the happiness you can imagine. And then there's a friend, best wishes, and happy birthday. And then lots of beautiful floral imagery in that stamp set. And then the set of dies. These are called the... Hmm, Blossoming happiness dies. I can't speak that language. I'm over here. Blossoming happiness dies that coordinate and cut out. I think pretty much all of these images are, um, you can die cut those with the dies, right? Um, okay, so let me show you the cards and then I'll kind of tell you about the different options available. So you guys know for my class to go kits, we do four cards and two of each of them. So you get all the parts and pieces to make eight cards in total. We have the first one, this happy birthday. Like, look at, oh. Just so much beautiful. This one, I put the sentiment on the inside. Oops, so let's see. You can do whatever you want. And this is like my favorite little stamp in there too, right? We've got this beautiful friend card. You guys know this though. You can always um, put whatever sentiments you want on here. You are wonderful in every way is what I use. And I loved using the little glossy dots on the cards as well. Okay, so option number one includes the stamp set and the dies. This is a $49.50 value plus tax and shipping, right? So it's a it's an awesome, beautiful set of dies and stamps. You get a full package of the glossy dots. You get a full package of the Hues of Happiness Designer Series paper and a full bolt of the linen thread. Hey, Monica, hello, plus the PDF tutorial that tells you step-by-step -step how to put your cards together. Um, oh, and actually you get the linen for thread for free in option number one. So let's see, option number one is $93. Option number two is if you already have the stamp set and dies, you need to make sure you have the stamp set and the dies because you have to do your own stamping and die cutting. You get the full package of paper, the linen thread, and the glossy dots, plus the PDF tutorial to make all of those four cards, two of each of them, right? Option number two is $40. If you just want the PDF tutorial, that's $15 as always, always available even after the RSVP deadline passes. And then option number four is for my Inkspired Stampers. Anyone in my downline, they can actually get the PDF tutorial for free or they can get the make and takes, all the parts and pieces for just $12. So let me know if you're interested. RSVPs are due, uh, I think it's three weeks from today, Friday, May, or is that? 
Is it two or three weeks? Anyway, Friday, May 27th, RSVPs are due right before Memorial Weekend. Um, the kits will ship out no later than June 8th. And if you need it shipped to you, it's an additional $10 for the priority mail shipping. So let me know if you have any questions. I would love to get one of these to-go kits sent out to you. All right, I'm scooting that out of the way. I think, woohoo! We are ready to do our stamping now, ladies. I need to find my grid paper. I think I'm all good here. Okay, here we go. Let's do our stamping. Thank you guys for um, hanging out with me today too. I truly appreciate that. Mm. Okay, so we have our card number one with kind of a fun flippy fold on it. We've got this, you're on my mind with that little flip right there so you can just write whatever you like on the inside of your card. We use some of that new metallic ribbon with our ink colors. And I actually used on both of the cards, I used this Nature's Print stamp set. So we've got the You're On My Mind, there's a little hello there, a heartfelt thank you and best wishes and happy thoughts. And then some more beautiful imagery that has dyes that cut these things out also. Hello, Miss Deb. Okay, so here we go. Let me tell you a guys about, we're going to give you dimensions first. So featuring some of our new in colors, we have Tahitian Tide and Parakeet Party. So here's our card base, Tahitian Tide cardstock. So we actually cut it down a little bit. So this was actually an 11 inch long piece of cardstock. So we cut it off at eight and a half inches and then we scored it along the eight and a half inside at four and a quarter inches. So I'm gonna flip this one this way so they're the same. And then my eight and a half inch length piece, I scored it at three inches, okay? So that's gonna make that fold there, okay? Then we have a piece of our Parakeet Party cardstock that measures the four inches by five and a quarter inches. And that's gonna go right to there, right? Then I know the colors are beautiful, aren't they, Deb? These are our new in colors. Okay, then we have another piece of Tahitian Tide cardstock that measures two and a half by eight and a half, and I scored this one at four and a quarter. So you're gonna flip that in like that, and then that's gonna lay kind of inside there, right? Then we have this piece of designer series paper that goes on there that measures two and a half by four inches, and that's some of, thank you, Brenda. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. This is so pretty too. Like I kind of wondered, although that might be competing, right? But I loved those two patterns together. And you know, I should tell you too, Brenda, while you're saying that, Stampin' Up! makes it so easy, right? To make these projects, these cute projects, because they give us all of the color. So this is the full package of Tea Boutique Designer Series paper that Bonnie won for putting in her online order. And right on the back here, in super teeny tiny print. They also put it in the catalog, but they tell you these are the colors. Creme cake, crushed curry, fresh freesia, garden green, orchid oasis, parakeet party, petal pink, starry sky, sweet sorbet, and Tahitian tide. So I looked at this and thought, okay, that says it's parakeet party. So we're going with that. And then another one is Tahitian Tide, which you can just see like a little bit of kind of turquoise in there. So that's how I picked like the colors that I wanted to use it was basically right off of like my cheat sheet on my designer series paper pack. So they do make it super easy to make cute projects, right? Um, Cause they just tell you, they give you like exactly what you need to know. Okay, so I don't know if I told you guys about this size of designer series paper, if I did, I'm gonna do it again. We've got two and three quarters by four inches and then that piece goes right there. Then I just have some kind of strips of Parakeet Party Basic White and Tahitian Tide for our stamping and die cutting right there, okay? All right, so we're gonna scoot these things kind of up out of the way. We are gonna do our stamping. So just on our basic white piece, we're gonna grab, and again, this is the, another thing that makes Stampin' Up! so great. We've got our Tahitian Tide ink that coordinates with our Tahitian Tide cardstock. It's, um, they basically make it so you don't have to buy any other products because all the Stampin' Up! stuff coordinates so well together. Like here's my Tahitian Tide ribbon too, right? So just don't buy anything other than Stampin' Up! And you'll never have to worry, like does this color go with this color? Because they always all coordinate together. I see a lot of people, like especially at my retreats, spending a lot of time trying to figure out 
oh, I bought this at Walmart or Hobby Lobby and does it, does it coordinate? And it doesn't because it's not quite the right same shade, you know, or color is, is what we have. So just only buy Stampin' Up! stuff and then it always will all coordinate together. <laughs> That's my little plug there, ladies, okay? Okay, we're gonna do our die cutting with that awesome new must-have set of dies. The, what are they called? The Stylish Shapes dies. So we've got that one and that one. I think we can go that one there, right? Okay, so I'm gonna pull these out again so you can see them not backwards so we do have yeah that's one two three four five we got six circles with the stitching i think that's five squares and then four of the banners again with all of the stitching so we're going to use the biggest banner and then the second and third largest of the circles okay so that one goes there that one goes there Ooh, that's not right i must use this on another one <laughs> i'm like that's not gonna fit on my cardstock I think, okay, I'm not doing this right, am I? Oh, mm -hmm, I see, okay. I'm <laughs> Now I get what happened. I used these on both of the cards and apparently I didn't keep out. Okay, so we're gonna use this size on that circle. That one is gonna go right there. All right, I see what's happening, <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought I was helping myself, but only kind of apparently. Yeah, because like I said, I use these dies on the other card too, and I think those dies are the ones that we're going to use on the other card. Okay, I think we're good now. <laughs> yes, I'm such a good helper for myself, kind of, sort of, sometimes, and sometimes not. <laughs> All right, so check out the awesome stitching that these, oh, and it makes it on kind of the negative image too so if you want to use this and have something peeking behind it you can do that and you got the stitching on there too okay and then here's the stitching on the banner itself same thing happens with this one right where we've got let me scoot these there so we've got the stitching on the negative and then what we're actually going to use and one more time same thing on the circle you've got the stitching Something could, you know, that could pop through. You could, that could be kind of fun, right? And then there's the stitching on our circle too. Okay. Scoop those guys out of the way. And I think we are ready to kind of put the, oh no, we got to do one more thing. I forgot. We are embossing this um, uh, parakeet party. We're going to emboss with our new, where is it? Right here in front of my face the gingham embossing folder. Okay, so let's do that, and then we're gonna be ready to put our card together. Okay. All right, so we need our cut and emboss machine one more time. This is a regular, not 3D, I guess I should say, embossing folder, so we're gonna use our number three plate on the bottom. We're gonna put one of, or I'm sorry, our number one plate on the bottom. Our number three plate, and then our cardstock, and our paper, and then another number three plate on top. And we're just gonna crank this right through here. Okay. And you guys wanna see the embossing, right? <laughs> it's always like this aha moment when your flat boring paper turns into this beautiful textured gingham paper there, right? Love, 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 love that. Okay, here we go. Now we are ready because that's what I went to grab this piece and I'm like, oh, wait a minute. We need to um, emboss this piece. And let's see. Okay, so we're going to put this one right inside here aren't these colors so two of our new in colors right here ladies parakeet party and tahitian tide right then we're gonna put this piece of t boutique designer series paper it's gonna go right there and then this piece of t boutique isn't that so pretty though i love both of these kind of um leafy floral patterns right on this one, we're going to use the stripes, though. I like them both. Um, I love stripes, too, though. Okay, so that piece is going to go there, right? Then 
This is kind of our card, the inside of our card. So we're doing this run it, tip it back, and run it, tip it back. This is basically going to be centered right inside there. Looks pretty good, right? Okay, so that goes there, that goes there, and then we are trying to see how did I do this? Okay, I. Mm, okay, so this is gonna go on here. We're gonna put adhesive. I put um, dimensionals behind the whole thing. So I um, just adhered these pieces, right? So these are all adhered together. And then I put dimensionals behind the whole thing and then popped them up, oops, on the card. Okay, so we've got this one, oops. There and there, and then we're going to just lay that little buddy. You're on my mind, right? Then we are going to make like a double bow with our metallic woven ribbon. So you kind of just put them together and act, try as best you can. Um, act like you are making a bow with one. <laughs> um piece of ribbon, but instead you have two. And if you're kind of um, nice to the ribbon and talk sweet to it, it works pretty well for you. Then we need a glue dot. Here we go. Easiest way is to just leave them right on there and just put your ribbon right down on the glue dot. Okay, we're gonna put that, you're on my mind. And then we have our new, the in color matte decorative dots. So we're gonna just grab a couple of these little buddies here. We're gonna put one Tahitian Tide, I kind of put right there. Grab another, we'll, and you can kind of see they're like an, an ombre kind of effect. So you've got lighter to darker in each of our colors. And then maybe we'll add one more little guy, kind of put him right about there. And there we go. <laughs> thank you, Robin. You love it. And X or uh, capital letters. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So, so cute, right? You're on my mind. Just send a little card to somebody just to say, hello, how are you doing? Right. And then the cute little flippy fun fold there. Yeah. Okay. So don't forget if you order through me, I'm going to send you one of these cards as a thank you. And this next card I'm going to share with you in just a moment. I'm going to just clean up here real quick. You guys know Love to use my chamois. I always say, I don't know where the ink goes, but you just rub it on here and it just like, dis well, it kind of just gets absorbed into that chamois, I guess, right? Okay, so we're gonna just scoot these things out of the way so I don't, it's more so so I don't get confused and like think, oh, I need that product and I don't because it's not for that card. Okay, I think I am gonna use those though. Okay, so here we go. Next card, ladies, another fun one with some kind of different colors, but again, featuring the T Boutique Designer Series paper and the new, what are those called, stylish shapes? Yes, stylish shapes dies. So that's what confused me. Ah, now I got it figured out. So we're gonna use those two circles and that banner on this one here, but then again, with more of those fun prints and patterns in that T Boutique Designer Series paper. Okay, let's see, so we're gonna grab some stamps. Okay, all right, let me tell you about measurements here. So this time, again, stamping up the beauty of it, Sweet Sorbet ink that matches our Sweet Sorbet cardstock. And then this was crushed curry, they told me that in the list of colors, so I was like, that's easy enough, I'll use some crushed curry cardstock on the card as well. Okay, so we're gonna start with our card base, the Sweet Sorbet cardstock. This time along the eight and a half inch side, we cut it at four and a quarter, yes, four and a quarter inches. And then along the 11 inch side, we scored it at five and a half inches, okay? We do have a piece of basic white cardstock on the inside of our card. <clears throat> that one is right here that measures the four by five and a quarter. That's gonna go there. Then we have, let's see, a piece of crushed curry cardstock that measures three and one quarter by four. And then a piece of T Boutique designer series paper that measures three by three. And that's gonna layer right on there 
another piece of T Boutique Designer Series paper that measures two inches by four and a quarter inches, and that's just gonna go across the bottom of the card. And then we have Basic White, Sweet Sorbet, and Crushed Curry cardstock for our die cutting and our sentiment. As I'm thinking of it too, all of the colors, the dimensions, the product codes, everything that you need to order these products and recreate them will be on my blog at Gathering Ink with a K, gatheringinspiration.com this afternoon. Okay, so we are gonna just, we only have a little bit of stamping. We're gonna do that. So we've got our Sweet Sorbet ink. Okay, so we're gonna stamp our best wishes and happy thoughts in Sweet Sorbet ink right on there. Okay, I think I was like, all of a sudden I'm like, did I give myself enough room? But I think we're good there. And then we're gonna do one of these pretty flowers. Oh, I love that. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. And that is this image right here in our Nature's Prince stamp set. Okay, that's all we need. That one there. All right, let's do our die cutting. This and this and this and this. And then we can put things together. Whoops. <laughs> I'm trying to move the plates. Um, trying to help myself out, but that didn't really work very well on that case, did it? Okay. All right, so we've got that circle and that circle and that sentiment. I think we're going to be able to fit all of this on here. Okay. That one there, that one there, that one there. Okay. So just so long as those fit on, this is the only one we need to line up here. And that works. Okay. Hmm, I feel like that guy moved. Did you guys see it move? It's not too bad. Scoot that up just a touch. Okay, I think we are good. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are enjoying these. It's just so fun to play with new products and new colors, isn't it? So again, the stitching on both pieces there, right? Okay, same thing with our sweet sorbet piece and with our banner. Okay. We can put this little baby together now too. All right, where's my adhesive? Okay, we're gonna put this, the fun crushed curry striped paper. We're gonna put this one down on the bottom. I know why I like to have the yellow on my stripes. The white was on that end and I didn't like it, so I had to flip it over. Okay, this little um, print, the little floral print on here, I just think is so cute. Do you love that? It's just so sweet. I think, okay, run it and tip it back. I'm getting really good at using that. <laughs> stamp and seal. Finally, it probably only took me a couple years, feeling like. Okay, this piece is going to go on the inside. Okay, there's our basic white with that beautiful flower there. Next, we are going to build our sentiment. So we've got our circles with the stitched shapes and then our sentiment right here okay so i have to like show you guys again can you guys see i don't know if you can see all the stitching on there i'm not sure if i'm getting a good angle or not but i love so happy they brought something new out i love the banners too. use those crisp clean lines a lot on my projects okay so we're gonna just put this guy be right about there right then I decided um, I wanted so I showed you guys this is the gray granite what's this called the shimmer ribbon so that's what I used on this one but I thought I wanted to show you guys some of the twine too so this is our new in color twine the sweet sorbet in color twine I actually already because I was trying to decide if I liked it or not but I made a little double bow with that twine and I thought that was pretty cute also. So we're gonna actually use the twine on this one. Use our little glue dot. And we're just gonna put that right down there, right? And then last, 
because you know, like I said, I always have to add my bling, right? We're gonna add a couple of these little iridescent rhinestones. And these are the little guy that you can win um, if you share this Facebook Live video, this one we're doing right now, if you share the class to go kit post, or if you sign up for my email list, you can win those beautiful iridescent rhinestones. All right, I think we did it. What do you guys think? Isn't that a fun card, right? Best wishes and happy thoughts. And you can use either of those, rib, the ribbon or the twine. I think they're both beautiful because you can see, I think it actually says this is crumb cake, but I think those neutral colors, you can kind of bend them, especially since it's such a little amount. The gray granite works perfectly on there too. Okay, ladies, thank you so very, very much for hanging out with me today. Uh, you know, I always have to do my quick recap just to make sure everybody knows what's going on. And like I said, I do not get too many online orders, so your chances are always really good of winning. What are we giving away? This next Facebook Live, the Sending Smile stamp set. Online order in of at least $30. Get your name in the drawing. You automatically get one of each of these cards as a thank you from me for your online order. This is our host code for May. Make sure you use that host code. And then if you bump your order up to over $50, you can pick from the Demo Design Dream Team PDF tutorial. And this is my project in there or the Opal Rounds. Either one of these free with an order. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying the sunshine, the beautiful summer weather we are having. And we will see you guys all on our next Facebook Live. Thanks, guys. Have a good weekend. Bye, everybody.